great to be in a space full of the kind of buoyant vitality. So often when we're talking about health today, we're talking about the inequalities that we face and all that we suffer and how difficult it is. But I think um, being in a space like this, we're reminded about what's important and that's about how we connect and how connecting is fun and engaging and it feeds our soul. Having a conversation with someone, listening to what's going on and kind of going, oh, actually, I know where you need to go and speak to. Here's some information or going that way. And that's happening you know, across the borough. What's really important about the Heart Programme is, is that you getting involved in it because it is about research into communities and health inequalities. And the focus really of the infrastructure is to develop research into the building blocks of what good health and well-being is. The health and well-being bus is outside. It goes currently to around 19 different locations across the borough and we're really keen that we start spreading the word and making as many links as possible. We support connectors to go out in the community and help people in their community. So that could be people on your housing estate, people in your church, in your mosque, it could be you know, some sporting activities you do. And the idea is that you're signposting people, but you're also supporting people to access services. An event like today is important for our social prescribing link workers because it brings community groups together, small kind of grassroots groups and like larger organisations. And it helps kind of share information. So they know how to link into us but we also know how to refer onwards. And that's important for residents because we're giving them plenty of choice. We're able to offer them something they may not be aware of. It's very important to connect with link workers because for us it's important to understand what they do, what range of people they help, just to get to know their organisations. It's really important for the link workers to understand what RTW Plus can deliver for their patients because they are clearly the link to the patient and it's very difficult for RTW Plus as an organisation to speak directly with the, with the patients. So they're that all important connection. The importance of Water and Vice being in an event like this today is because we work locally in Lambeth supporting autistic people from the global majority community. We choose to be black and ethnic minority, we choose to call it the global majority because there's a lot of people sitting at home without access to some of the community services that we offer. Autistic people, young people mostly are lacking in social and development skills. So Autism Voice is here to meet other people, let the, um, the link workers know that we are here. I think for me as well, the intergenerational aspects of these organisations and our work is so important. So historically we focus as an organisation on younger people and we're starting now, now we have a base within Brixton actually bringing in older generations to connect to those younger people. This has been our first ever Community Connections event, a day where we've had so many organisations get to know each other, um, but also our link workers as well. We're so pleased with the turnout here and we're hoping to make this a regular thing uh, because the energy that's in the room has just been fantastic. And we really, really want there to be a lot more connection like this across Lambeth because for our residents, that's, that's what it's all about, making sure that they know what's happening. And the first part to that is having these amazing conversations between organizations and link workers as well.